I don't do intros anymore. I don't know. I I don't like intros. Um. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What? Oh my God! His inventory. Is that what you're confused about? Yes, dude. Oh my God! I thought it was a God, bug. I thought I you clicked on the ward that. and the ward was bugged and had an inventory, and I was like, oh, that was no. Weird. Yeah, he's rushing radiance. He's rushing, dude. No way. He goes radiance into bottle. There's no way he's dead again. <laughs> Holy fuck. So yeah, this Oh, it, that was nice. Yeah, they keep pulling that one. This is a Ricky 5, just to just to confirm that. I'm not sure who the 5 is, but Spirit Breaker is last hitting. Bro, look at that damage, dude. Okay. I don't know. I've been watching the minimap. Curious what Sanking's up to, too. I, there's just... They're just fighting to the death. They're oh! both gonna die, I think. I think he's dead too, isn't he? He's dead. Yes, he's dead. Oh! Oh! Dude! Oh! oh. That that Ricky regen, man, actually saved him. Oh. Re? Oh, man, you're right. If the flag bearer was not there, he would've... Him, maybe. Well, he's dead anyway, I guess, but... Oh, all right. Maybe there will be a trade? Uh oh. oh. Blood grenade? Oh, that's oh. unfortunate. This is just killing and fighting constantly, is what this is. Uh, eventually? Yep, yep. Very nice. <laughs> he buys back. Very confusing. Very confusing. Dude, it's always the guy with the fucking PMA names. And he walked out of base kind of and then teleported immediately into fighting them, is what's happening? Yes. Uh, In the tower? What, dude? Okay. <laughs> so that... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Not very PMA of him, I, I have to say. Does it just run out and he just forgets? Oh my god, dude. He is legitimately dying when Sandstorm runs out off cooldown. Oh, he got the sentry now. He knows. He's level 3. He has permanent uh, Sandstorm, dude. Oh, yeah. He yeah. can't prepare yeah. Alright, right into it. Yeah, just fighting. He's dead again. And he does have the Talisman of Evasion, by the way. So this is going to be a definitely Radiance into, into Bottle. So. Oh. Let's see. This is going to be 110, 85, so 195. Plus 150, so he will indeed not have enough mana for all of his spells. And the tip will be coming out. Uh, because, of course, Silencer ran top with a haste. And took down the Nature's Prophet with his 10 stolen int at 7 minutes. So I think the worst part of Dota is when there's a guy higher level than the minutes in the game. That usually doesn't feel so good. Uh, that's, a, that's a good point. Is he really gonna? He's gonna epi this, and he does. He's uh, figuring it out. As as I mentioned the earlier, of course, not enough mana for the burrow strike. Did you not watch this one already, dude? I don't know. That foreshadowing was like. Is this why you're an analyst? They pay you the big bucks. That's for this? right. Yeah. It's... Okay. It's, it's gonna be like a work. thousand gold, dude. <laughs> <laughs> that is so much he's gold for this point in the game. Oh my god. Ooh, he's got the arcane rune. That means he has mana for shit. That's awesome. Fuck yeah, dude. I'm sure he's going to get himself killed. Yep, looks like he'll be slowly going down here. And there's the buyback into TP. Immediate. Oh, loses the sentry battle. Yep, that's that's not good. That's going to be an instant death. Yeah, he's gone down. That's 14 and stolen at 9 minutes. You know, I would say that this game is over, but I know that it goes for 2 hours, so... Somehow this is actually not over. Okay, so here's the charge coming out. It's going to go through the Grimstroke, who's jungling. And, ooh, nice oh. leech. That's, uh, yeah, that's a double leech seed, so they can heal a lot in this. I've actually never seen that one, to be honest. On, Pretty uh, good. Okay. And he has more wards. Nature's to top. Yeah, he's just going to go right in on the Huskar again. He's got the armlet. Will he use the armlet is the real question here. I'm not sure if he knows there's an active. Okay. How does this look good and bad at the same time for both teams? It's so confusing. Both teams. I literally never know who's... <laughs> what do you mean, dude? The three wards, Talisman mean? of Evasion, Sand King Gank is fucking awesome. It always works out. Oh, shit. Double damage on the guy with 14 stolen in. Oh, that's not what you like to see. Why do both sides have a ward on their fucking lotus and, pool and, and there's a sentry. and a sentry so he saw sand king. Them. yeah he saw sand king there. no That's... but like why so he'll have sad. it after this. 38 but they're going for him they have no vision they're just going for him anyway tree 
Uh, it's just like a mystery sandstorm. They know he's in there. They don't have oh. detection on anyone. Oh, up to the high ground is what casters would say. He's owning them. Yeah, they're pinging that he's don't up there. That. Dude, he is owning oh. them. Don't There's no detection. Say he's owning them. There's no. He knows, man. He's clicked on all of them. Look, he's setting up for his Ricky. Oh my fucking god! You're right now. He's the Ricky. That he's dying. Oh my Wait, no, why did he press sandstorm? He's dead! Oh my god! No! Why? Oh, that's a shard on Silencer, too, so that's four int he just lost. Oh! This leech seed is quite value, I will say. I'm oh, just kidding, he's dead. Uh, Razor bot back? Okay, he's gonna show up to this fight. Uh, he's stealing so much int right now, and that guy's gonna live. 40 he's int! 18 oh. minutes, he has 40 int! Oh, that was actually Giga Chad from the oh. tree. Ah, there's the Radiance yeah. on Sand King. Here we go. All right, fuck yeah. Here's where it starts. <laughs> this is what he got caught red-handed doing by the Ricky. Like, that's what it's- <laughs> That's what it took the- Ricky's like, what the fuck? This is my opponent. They are. Yep. Now, how much- Oh, bro, look at Axe's mana. Dude, look at Axe's mana. You're fucking kidding me. Oh, no. Wait, you're rewind, kidding, rewind, you're rewind. kidding. So he has this right now. Wait, what? Oh, it's because he got it stolen. He got it oh, stolen. Oh, okay, he's getting okay, hit. Okay, okay. I mean, that's still bad, too. Yeah, Basically, that's... if everyone gets hit like once or twice, they're out of mana. Yeah, that's not good. They're going to oh. need some arcane boots, man. Oh. It's just Everyone's fighting. Dead. Okay, here comes the carry tree. Let's see what what sort of numbers he can pull here. He's been farming this whole time. Dude, Dude so it's like, look at the last hits right now. What the fuck? This, this Ricky is the five. He's got 25 last hits. And he's this much net worth. It's all kills. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> Spirit Breaker walks up, sees the Wisdom Rune, grabs the Observer thing, and then starts soloing this, which he's actually succeeding. Silencer walks up and tries to kill the Spirit Breaker, but the Glaive Bounces kill himself on the Tormentor. And also take down the Spirit Breaker. Just, just to be clear on what happened there. And then as that's happening, of course, Axe is diving the base and killing the Huskar. The Silencer buys back, trying to defend the throne. Treant is there. That's the carry. Silencer does a lot of damage because he has this Revenant's Brooch thing. This is such a fucking weird game. Looks like Grim is going to go down. Eventually, I think. I. He's got a haste. Okay. Oh, Ricky got stunned by that. Holy shit, look at this fucking silencer, dude. Okay, the blade mails. Very effective. Uh, this is gonna be a full 5v5. No, he's running away on Sand King. Not interested. Huskar's gonna go in. Leech Seed comes dude, if out. Two people pop, pop blade mail versus um silencer. I feel like he just can't play the he game. He <laughs> is going to kill himself on account of the glaze yes. bounce. Yeah, you're right. You're right. What a treat. How many trees are enchanted? Um, yeah, Boulder can go ahead and put paste in to how many. He's going to edit that in. Yeah, how many trees it, are... Yeah, yeah he'll can go ahead and count all of those. So the number will appear on the screen here, guys. Dude, Tree and Protector's gameplay has been nothing but this. Awesome. It's been awesome. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. It's been awesome. Oh, he got oh, him with the, the trees! Oh! oh! Bro! Oh my god, that, that was, was awesome. fucking he cool. He deserves that. That was really cool. Ah, he's gonna ult? Who did he ult? Just A the, bunch of just creeps, creeps, I think? Yeah. yeah. Oh, I see what he's doing. He's playing for the 40 second overgrowth cooldown talent. When you get to 25 on tree, you farm so fast because it's a 45 second cooldown on the ult. You just use it on all the all the uh, jungle camps, and then they die after you use it three times. Like you can see this camp. Ah, there's the oh tree ult. Forty five second cooldown, ladies and gentlemen. Yep. Did the troll die yet? Nope, not dead yet. Oh, soon it'll die. Next one ult, more ult, ult. One more ult. Yeah. As of course the huskar goes in. Everybody's hexed. There's a million trees everywhere. The grimstroke ult comes out. Doesn't blade mails. Silencer's killing himself. Is he? I don't know. There's some blade mail. He's down to the ricky. Oh, here's the first roach of the game. Of course, the Sand King is going to be trying to solo it here with the Bloodstone. Ah, he'll be epicentering it. 
I don't think these gentlemen are quite aware that it's a team game. As Ricky is diving the base. Yeah. This is a 3v3, actually. So this is an even fight. Top Barracks is going down to the Nature's Prophet. So this will be Megas. Yep, Ricky gets jumped by the Huskars, level 29. Ooh, Razor actually buying sentries. He's sick and tired of this fucking Ricky. He's just following him, laying sentries down on the ground. Not a great method for chasing a Ricky. I gotta say, there is a gem that you can buy. As the Nature's Prophet goes down to the Huskar, is Sand King succeeding in the Roche attempt? He is... It's actually a close 1v1. Sand King? Don't lose sight, Sand King. Don't get greedy. Come on. Nice. nice. So he got the first stages of the game at 53 minutes. Very nice. Okay. Uh, so Treant is mid. Ricky TP's in. Oh, Ricky actually has the gem himself. He's sick of the Treant Protector. He's two shot. He's gonna feed the gem immediately to them, which... Oh my god. Yeah, that's that's the oh, last thing. Oh, he has a hex now, dude. That's huge. Yeah. And, and a gem to catch all the dozens of invis guys out. Oh, oh, oh I see. Home. Oh, Big Daddy's got a rapier. That's uh, uh Dire's Ancient is under attack. That's a rapier on Nature's Prophet. He's feeding it right oh. away. Uh, that's not. Do they see it? They. They uh. tip him. They should see it once all the stuff clears up off the ground. Charge comes out on the Spirit Breaker. Can he recover the Divine Rapier? I don't think that's why he's there. Dude. Does he care about the Divine Rapier? He cares about trying to bash this guy. Oh, he sees it. Oh, he oh, got, got it. it. He's going to immediately lose it. I think all he did is bring attention to it. And Axe is... Yep, yep, he's pinging it now. They see it, they see it. I see, they're all bum-rushing it. Because they realized it's there. And now... Like, oh shit, that... <laughs> that Spirit Breaker had a Divine Wraith here. <laughs> <laughs> a very long time. Dyer's Ancient is under attack from some Treants. As Ricky and Huskar, they're gonna man fight 1v1. Stygian and Desolator. Dead again. Dead again. Okay, they win. That's game. Right? Uh, it should oh be game. Oh my god, I can see the fucking It replay, should be dude. game. Come on. Oh, not this fucking shit again, man. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Trina is just watching this like a <laughs> cuck in the corner. Bro. Is he, he's there. actually he's defeated. He's, he's actually defeated. Whatever. Dire's Ancient is under attack. Spirit Breaker goes in. He's got a shield. I'm hearing noises that I've never heard before in Dota. Ricky goes in, he's got the BKB, Refresher comes out from the Train Protector, he walks out of the Ricky Cloud, uses the ult once again. That's two heroes alive for the Dire versus four. This is gonna be hard for them to hold this out. Buyback comes out from the Grunstroke, Razor is up in six seconds. They could just focus the throne, I feel like. Dire's Angel is, is under attack by an Axe who does very pathetic damage. That is not a good hero to focus the throne. As Razor trying to hunt the Ricky. Over on the other side, Spirit Breaker going down to the pure damage from the Huskar. Nature's Prophet TP's in. Instead of going for the throne, he goes for the Tram Protector, who he does take down. That's two minutes on the deck. Razor's sucking him, but he's walking away. Invis, and then TP's. So he's going to pour it out to the fountain, where Ricky is also chilling with his rapier. Did you see Tram's gameplay in that entire fight, dude? What was the gameplay? Oh my fucking god. Why is he so obsessed with the tree? I oh. don't know. Look, he's going back for it, dude. Dude, why? Why? How? Why? Why is he doing that? Why can you even put multiple fucking eyes of the forest on this tree? Why does that dude, work? I don't, I don't I'm so understand. confused. He has a Daedalus on on him. You are correct. Grimstroke does have a Daedalus, so he will be doing a lot of damage. Speaking of damage, Silencer goes in. Double Hex. Huskar jumps the Ricky. He doesn't have an Aghanim Scepter, so it's not going to be taunting. Nature's Prophet kills the Grimstruck first. He could have killed the throne if he just TP'd somewhere else, but he's going to go for the heroes instead. Axe jumps in, gets the double call. That is everybody dead on the Dire. I think Triant Protector is going to go down a second time here if he's not careful. I think that's game. That should be game. Yep. That's going to be double rapier with the Sand King. Just to top it all off there. Thick, juicy boy.